Hi, welcome to Flap. And in this episode, we're at the Coombabar Wetlands, the Arundel section. This is part of a series of videos we're doing for the BirdLife Photography 2022 conference based at the Southport Sharks. The Rundle wetlands here are about oh, five minutes, 10k away from the uh, Southport Sharks. Very easy to get to. It is a little bit in the sort of back block, so you do have to get, drive through a little bit of suburbia to, to get to the entrances. In terms of entrances, this is quite a large um, area, the Arundel section, and there's multiple entrances around here. And what we'll do is we'll mark them off on the map and tell you the different ways to get through here. But basically, there's a set of tracks that go through the middle of the park and around the outside edges, and they all eventually meet up into these um, different entrances. And there's sort of a bit of a loop circuit through half of it as well. We've traditionally gone through one on Tea Tree Circuit, uh, but as we've been doing this video, we've been traveling around to the other entrances. And then honestly, the one where we're standing now doing this video is probably the best one to come to. So this will be the main one we mark off for you to come and do the tour. Reason why we say this, as soon as you come in, there's a nice lake system that goes down through here and you walk straight into this. You can follow that track down through there. It'll loop around the back. There's another small lake through the other side of the area through, through the uh, wetlands. Uh, what I suggest you do is when you hit that, do turn right, go up a little bit. There's a whole section of uh, tea tree um, Melaleuca type uh, swampland through that area, uh, which is why that area is called tea tree section. Um, and it's quite interesting to look at. You never know what you can find down in there wading through uh, those marshy type areas. Once you've done that, come back down, follow the loop back again, and then you'll hit a tea section. Go to your right, there's a very big reedy area up through there. Um, a lot of grass birds uh, you can find in through that area. And on that intersection, they're actually doing some work now and expanding that out. We've often gone through that section there and found lots of fairy wrens, fantails, all sorts of things. It's usually quite a busy little section in that corner. So keep your eyes open for that. And then you can just follow the path back down again and come back to this point and back into the car. So there is no parking uh, at this area. It's basically just side of the street parking. The roads are a little bit narrow, so be careful as you drive through. If you do come back to this point, if you may be able to see in the video behind us, but there is a little sort of um, park area through there. It's got a uh, table and chairs. It's got um, swings for the kids, but there doesn't seem to be any barbecue facilities and we can't see any toilet facilities around here either. In summary, the Coombabar wetlands, the Arundel section. Look, it's a nice place to come for a walk. It's a pretty little area. The paths are quite good. They're easy to walk along. Um, there's a good variety of birds that you can see because of the variety of habitats that exist around here. It is a very popular birding spot. It has a good bird list. So if you're in the area and it's not far from the sharks, I do recommend to come here and have a wander around and come and enjoy it. So until next time, this is Flap. Happy birding. <music>